a beautiful location and the football played here on the shores of Lake Como has been of a very aesthetically pleasing nature as well. Now we have the first of the final showdowns taking place. Arsenal aiming to finish their debut season in the next-gen series on a high by claiming third place in the playoff. Terry Burton's side were edged out by Chelsea in extra time in their semi-final on Friday. Burton's boys certainly showed just why they made it to the finals weekend during that narrow defeat to the Blues though, rallying from 3-1 down late on before being pipped in extra time. Plenty of quality from the North Londoners on show again this afternoon. Their opponents also faced an additional 30 minutes in their semi before Sporting were downed by Aston Villa. But aside from the defeat to Tony McAndrews' men on Friday and during the group stage this season, Sporting have a very strong record against English opposition. Tottenham, Liverpool and Manchester United all on the receiving end from the Portuguese team who, like Arsenal, could have easily been lining up on Monday rather than this afternoon. But they are sure to be motivated to end their second next-gen series campaign with a flourish. So the weather has come out to play this afternoon on the shores of Lake Como. The setting is perfect for this third-place showdown between Arsenal and Sporting Club de Portugal. Arsenal get us off and underway then, a good crowd in this afternoon. Sporting trying to play their way out from the back. I tell you what, that's not the best pass. Eisfeld with a real chance and Arsenal have the lead. Thomas Eisfeld on 27 minutes after a real gift from Sporting was gratefully gobbled up. Chelsea's players watching on, they're taking part in the final on Monday. Arsenal dangerous here for them, they've not cleared their lines and are punished. Wilson Manifer with a bullet-like strike to draw sporting level. And just like the first goal, the defending wasn't really the best. And they have seen plenty of top draw football over this weekend. That's a clumsy challenge and the referee says it's worthy of a penalty. Arsenal gave away possession for the first goal and now have given away a penalty. Ruben Semedo scores just as he did from the spot against Arsenal's North London enemies Tottenham Hotspur during the quarter-finals. It's a happier bench this afternoon. Sporting in front. Options either side. One of them is Ricardo Escayo. Escayo again and that will surely be that. It is a third goal for the Portuguese side and they are firmly on course now for a third place finish in the Next Gen Series 2012-2013. Ricardo Esgaio finding the net with 18 or so minutes to play. The Dermot Drummer you saw there watching on and his side are through to the final. Meanwhile, Sporting have finished this campaign with a third place finish in the Next Gen Series. It finishes Sporting 3, Arsenal 1.